In this video, I will show you how to replace a broken key on a casual WK500 keyboard. The shape of the replacement will depend on the location of the key. Only two you need is a Phillips screwdriver about 5 inch long. I also have a magnet taped onto a stick to the appear box for screws. Flip the keyboard over and set it on some cushion. Here I use some bubble wrap. Remove all the screw in those cavities on the back side. but not these screws. Flip the keyboard right side up again. Dislodge the keyboard trim from the back casing. Dislodge the control panel side from the back casing. Be careful not to break the trim. Remove the four screws that hold down the key set. Lift the upper end of the top key set slightly and push down to disengage it from the latch. Remove any black tips on the old key set, place them on the new key set. Apply lubricant on the guiding plate for each key, if needed. Reverse the process to install the two key sets. One thing to note is that some of the black key set overlap with neighboring set of white keys. If that's the case, all the white key set on top need to be removed to get to the black key set. Check the function of the key after all the screws on the key set are tightened. The squeaky noise on one of the black key went away after the black key set was taken out and cleaned. So you think I'm slow? Wait till you get to your 70. Thanks for watching.